The first thing to do is to open the file with a mannequin of your chainer. Your task is to dress it up. We have three layers to work with. The top, the bottom, the hat. Let's start with the top. The main tool to paint your chainer's clothing is the brush. Choose the color you need and start creating your chainer's torso. Please note that you can only paint the chainer's body for this layer, so don't use the attach or erase buttons. Don't forget about the inside parts of the torso. All of them should be painted, otherwise the naked parts of your chainer will be shown when moving. Start adding the details. You can use the mirror mode to make symmetrical patterns. You can try different colors to find the best color combination. Let's get to the arms. Please note that you can't add 3D elements here either. Don't forget to paint the inside parts of the arms also. Let's move to the bottom layer. The rules are the same with the top. No modeling or resizing allowed. You can only paint the chainer's body here. So please choose the paint button only when using the brush tool. All the edges of the bottom layer should be painted as well. Paint the legs and the boots. The last part of the chainer's outfit is the hat. Within the boundaries of this cube, you can create your own designs. For this part, you can create 3D elements. Use the attach button to add the elements and erase buttons to cut them out. Start modeling the hat. Please note that you can't erase any parts of the chainer's head. You can both paint some parts of the head and attach 3D elements. Add some details, but try not to add too many of them in the facial zone. It's time for the final touches. Experiment with colors and choose the best option for your outfit. The outfit is finished. Save your art in the Vox format and submit your work.